different people after stroke are able to take in different levels of information and in different ways. My expectation was that those involved in my care would talk to me about my brain in a way that they assumed that I was an intelligent person who understood about a part of my body. My ability to concentrate um, and process you know, information, uh, I was relying on my family. Being able to evaluate all the information that's coming at you after you've had a stroke is, is quite enormous. And so, yeah, if you're having problems concentrating, yeah, it, it makes it very challenging to work out. I've become very visual now and I need visual prompts. My memory isn't as good as what it should be. I'm not able to follow through with things. Physically, I'm fine, but mentally, I just can't cope with the stresses and strains that, that go on, the memory of, of what needs to be done. So I'm, I'm unable to, to carry on in that regard. My memory's not as good as it used to be, just with little things, you know, and sometimes it's just a word you can't get, and you can't get it, so you'll change your sentence or what you're talking about and then you're in bed that night and you think, that's the word I was looking for it just comes to you. My brain doesn't filter noise or visual busyness or um, fluorescent lights where we move through a busy world and information we don't need we just let it go and don't pay attention to it my brain pays attention to all of it my working memory, the, the bit of my brain that can move me through the day, part of it's attending to stroke deficits and part of it is trying to work out what, what on earth is going on in this crazy busy world. And, and with what's left, I'm still trying to do everything that I did before my, my, my stroke and more. How you look at things and how you see it is not synchronised, you know, or how you think you should feel about something, it's not synchronised. My spatial perception was completely rotten. So things like I would put t-shirts on inside out and back to front and not realise I'd done it. And I learned how to cope with that, but it's, it's really funny because at first you don't realise what you're doing and you have to stop and think and having to actually concentrate on having to, things that you just did automatically before is really hard. And one of the other inf things that happened with that spatial perception problem was that I was having trouble reading. If you're reading a line of text and there's a line of text underneath it, you get to the edge of the page and you've got to bring your eyes back to this, this point and I couldn't do it. I kept missing. So I had a piece of paper sitting on the book and as I got to the end of the line, instead of just using my eyes to come down, I'd move the piece of paper and then that would mark the line. Over a space of about three or four days of doing that, I didn't need it anymore because the brain does relearn. One of the things that I found very hard to come back to grips with, funnily enough, was cleaning my teeth. I could have the toothbrush, I could have the toothpaste, but what do I do with it? Mm -hmm. And that took a bit of retraining. One of my problem, I can't hear numbers. I can see what it is, number, but I can't hear what somebody says as well. It was interesting, Lloyd lost the ability to understand money. He got in the queue in the wheelchair and he looked at this $10 and he said he thought, what's this? and he had no idea what, he knew it was money, but he didn't know how much he had and he didn't know whether he'd have enough to buy a cup of coffee. Whilst I wasn't an accountant, I, I used to have no trouble in balancing the books and I couldn't understand why I couldn't understand. I could remember all the passwords, the bank account numbers. I do a lot of Sudoku and a lot of brain training. So um, it didn't affect, affect that at all. Um, I still do a lot of that sort of thing. Leslie uh, picked up writing very quickly, quickly with the left hand. Yes. Um, after the stroke. All her mental faculties were there, but um, even uh, maths, um, reading. So even the things that didn't want work 100% at first, they've all come back. So it just takes a bit longer. <laughs>